Hi, everybody. Welcome to Long Island. He's Ray Ferraro. I'm James Sabolski. All the cliches get to be thrown out for this one. This is right in my wheelhouse, Ray. Win or go home. Do or die. All of it, buddy. Yeah, stop it or the game's going to be over. Just think, your entire season is down to the next couple of hours. Centers are lined up. Official ready to drop the puck. You can feel the intensity of this one. Total playoff atmosphere. We're underway. Moves it quickly over to Dumoulin. Stones him in front. The Islanders get a hold of the puck along the boards. There's the whistle, and a penalty is coming up on this one. Pretty easy call to make, hooking right here. Well, he gets a stick around his waist, then he stops skating. It's almost like he's advertising for the penalty. Both teams lining up for the face-off, and it's a chance to see if there's actually some power in this power play. What a great opportunity to get the first strike on the board. Scoreless game, you go on the power play, you want to attack this. You can change the way the game looks in the next two minutes. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. They get it out of the defensive end. The Islanders gain possession along the wall. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. Retrieves the puck, trying to kickstart this power play. They gotta do a better job entering the zone here. They don't have a shot on net, and it's turning into a conditioning drill. They're going back and forth, up and down the ice. We'll get another look at that hit. I love this hit. He closes off the ice. There's nowhere to go. He lays the shoulder in for a big hit. We're still in the early stages of this period. We're still scoreless. And a good read to get possession there with the two centermen tangled up. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. No one home on that play. Nice zone entry from the right side. Taken along the wall by Rust. Handles the puck at the point. Pokes it away in his own end. Takes the feed at center from the right wing. Bailey's got him along the wing. Reaches out and pokes it away. Crosby's now out of the box, and we are back to even strength. He was locked in there. And nobody's going to be very happy about that one, James. No real chances generated. No momentum game. Just a couple of minutes roll off the clock. The Islanders win it, and he slides it quickly to Lee. Takes a shot. Long jam in front. That's broken up. Here's a short pass to Lee. Puck scooped up by Malkin. Sends a pass over. New York's got the puck along the wall. Scrum along the boards. Moves the puck. Chance in front. Big save. Yeah, he got out tight to him, James. There's nowhere for that puck to go. Moves it on over to Crosby. New York's got the puck in their own end. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Everly. Cross ice pass. And it's knocked away with a stick save by the goaltender. Slides it quickly to Ruido. Along the right wing, they enter the attacking area. Here he is in front, and they can't connect. Barlamov's going to opt for the whistle and give everybody a chance to breathe. Sometimes you get running around as the shift gets long. This helps. Lots of hockey left to be played in this period. Still no score in this one. Good read by the winger as the two setters tie up. Denied by the goaltender. Loose puck battle along the boards. Quick pass to Pollock. Slides the puck across to Clutterbuck. Smart defensive play here in the open ice. Pass across to Pedersen. Looking to make something happen along the boards. A chance! And the puck skips off the glove. And now it's to Pedersen. Takes the feed. Here's a shot! Makes the save. Pulak's been tripped up, and we got a penalty coming up here. New York's got it along the wall. Quick feed to Clutterbuck. And here comes the judgment from the official. Now uh, you react, you go to get the puck, and you stick your stick into the guy's feet. Down you go. Two minutes off to the box.
New York's got another opportunity here on the man advantage. Well, they've had some chances. The goaltender's getting way too clean a look on the power play. They need some traffic there. Unleashes a cannon! Denies him with the save! 42 seconds. We haven't even hit the midway mark of the period. Still looking for our first goal. Pittsburgh's won the draw. Here's a chance to get it out of their own end. Call that a win for the penalty killers on that one. Yeah, he slams it off the glass. Now the power play's got to go back to get set up. Here's a chance right in the slot. He scores! Now the power play comes through. They move the puck nicely, and they're able to capitalize on the extra man. Play's job is to create shots, and if you can create them from the most dangerous areas of the ice, you're going to be successful. Dead center in the slot, he doesn't miss. New York's got the opening goal in this contest. So much time left, but it just feels better to play with the lead, and they must be pretty happy to score that quickly. Puck grab by McCann. Pittsburgh's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Battle along the boards. The Penguins gain control of the puck against the wall. Passes it over to Bailey. And now it's grabbed by Beauvillier. 18 seconds. Cutting to the slot. He scores! Two goals in 50 seconds. So quickly on the board. Conversely, deflating for the other team. Man, that is a kick in the shins right there. They just couldn't stop the bleeding. He's probably got about two seconds from the time that puck's delivered to find it. He can't see it, so he drops into the butterfly and hopes it hits him. More than half the period left to play. New York's been the better team here over the last few minutes, increasing their lead to two. Takes the pass. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it along the wall. Here they are on the attack. And he loses control of the puck. Here they come on the attack. Puts it up front. And that one's turned away. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it against the wall. They've got numbers. It's a two-on-one. Cuts into the paint. Here's a shot denied by the goaltender. Scrum along the boards as they battle for the puck. Taken by Boychuk. The Islanders take the puck through the neutral zone. And he uses his reach to disrupt the play. The Islanders take it along the wall. Excellent stick work on the play. Deflected away. Nice defensive use of the stick there. Grabs the puck. Takes the pass as he banks it off the wall. Great use of the body to knock him off the puck. Receives the pass. New York's got it in the offensive zone. Feeds it down low. Moves it to Everly. Slides the puck over. Close save. How did he get a piece of that? New York's gained possession along the boards. Picked up along the wall by Barzell. Puck set across the blue line. Blocked in traffic. Stopped by the goaltender. The Penguins take over on possession. They go on the attack through center. The Islanders gain possession in their own end. And he sends it across to Lee. And he slides it quickly to Everly. Smart heads up play to intercept the pass. What a steal in his own end. Puck picked up by Pulak. Passes over to Lee. New York's got the puck in the corner. Stopped by the goaltender. Again the denial by the goaltender. Really sharp. Never loses sight of the puck to make the second save. 
He had to be on top of his game to make that stop. That's a great scoring chance, and he turns it aside. The Islanders have had multiple scoring opportunities here in this first and could easily have a much bigger lead. And a solid job tying up his opponent. Moves it quickly over to McCann. Hard hit on the play. Wow, did he ever finish him hard. And when he dropped, he also dropped his stick. Now he's got to collect himself. Looks like a yard sale out there. Moves the puck to Beauvillier. Here's a short pass to Nelson. Takes the feed. From the point, looks to make something happen. Handles the puck. And the play continues. Move to the middle. Quick pass to Beauvillier. Made the stop on that play. Hey, I'd like to see that again. Nowhere to go as he lays the shoulder onto the hit. Right through the body, right there, is a big hit. Past the midway mark of the frame, and it's a comfortable 2-0 lead we're looking at right now. And they take possession. Nice job tangling him up on the draw. The centermen glide into position. New York's won the faceoff. Denies him! Scrum ensues along the boards. Komarov's looking to make something happen here in the corner. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the boards. And now it's grabbed by Clutterbuck. That opportunity's rejected. Now we'll get another look at this. That's a good shot, but the goalies get the blocker up to make the save. New York's got it in the offensive zone. Right to the middle! Traps the puck away. Quick feed to Clutterbuck. Nice pass. And an easy glove save on the play. The Islanders have had way more chances offensively, and as a result, they're leading in this one. Well, that's one way to win the draw as he skates away with the puck after the two centers were tied up. Moves it to Kapanen. Pittsburgh's got the puck against the half wall. And he gets a paddle on that one. The shooter's right in the guts of the ice, but the goalie squares up, spreads out, and makes the save. Trying to get back on the attack now. Kapanen's moving it ahead. The Islanders get a hold of the puck in the open ice. Centering pass! Let's it go from the slot! Made the stop on the play. Nice move by the goalie to get out close to the shooter. Stick save! The Penguins scoop it up along the boards. Now he takes it over the line. Right out front! Takes a shot! And there's the save. This shot comes from a real dangerous area on the ice. But the goalie's in position, and he makes a nice stick save. More than half the frame has been played here, and it's a 2-0 hockey game. Snatches the puck with the two centermen locked up. Locks him down in front of the net. Can't keep a hold of it after that hit. Grabbed along the board by Pichon. The Islanders have it against the wall. Good defensive effort to poke it away. Pittsburgh's moving it up the ice. Moves it quickly over to Nelson. Gets the puck in deep. The Penguins gain possession along the wall. Tries to get the puck over to Sevier. They've got numbers. Great defensive effort with the stick. Picked up along the boards by Nelson. A little crashing and banging forces the turnover. Puck scooped up by Bailey. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it along the wall. Now a quick pass to Tanev. Sends the pass over. Shot, and he comes up with it. Barlamov's strength is technically he is outstanding. Here's a save, and the puck's in the corner. Sends a pass over. Takes a shot and makes the save. The Islanders get a hold of the puck along the boards. 
Scooped up along the wall by Nelson. Denies him with the save. That's a pretty good scoring chance. That's a chance the shooter thinks might go in, but the goalie turns it aside. The Islanders have been the better team so far in this first period. They've had multiple scoring opportunities and as a result have the lead. Nice job tying up his opponent. Through the neutral zone, moving the puck along the side. Look out, a two-on-one with the stop. The Islanders take possession in the defensive end. Everly swooping in on the attack. Here's the pass. That goes off the twig. The Penguins grab possession to the puck. From the right side, they gain the zone. Stays with it. Wrist shot from the slot, turns it away. Oh, you're not going to get a better chance than that, but the goalkeeper does a great job. Good heads-up play in the defensive zone. Quick shot, denies them in close. No room for the shooter. The goaltender snuffed it out. And it's a quick pass to Malkin. And the officials are calling a delayed penalty here. Looks like a trip. Letty's going off to the box for two minutes. Reaches in with his stick and gets nabbed for the trip. The Penguins get their man advantage unit out there for the first time tonight. Their first power play of the night will commence with the faceoff. Win the draw, you've got puck control in the offensive zone. Locks it down with a stop. I think he got a blocker on that one. Puck slid down the ice. Pittsburgh's got it from behind the net. Here's a short pass to Rust. Through the neutral zone now, picking up steam. Wrists one, can't get it to go. Trying to get the puck out of his own end. And they get it out of the zone, and where are they headed to, Ray? Uh, all alone! Huge save on the breakaway. Really good patience in net by the goaltender. He outweighted the shooter, and then made the stop. From in close, and that shot gets caught in traffic. The first 20 minutes of this one is all said and done with as the horn sounds. The Islanders backed up all that talk from the morning skate. They wanted to get off to a good start. They certainly have done just that, leading by a pair of goals. Don't miss the chance to see the greatest talents in the world when they visit our city. See the official arena website for details on upcoming concerts. As both teams get a breather, so will we. We'll take a quick pause for the cause. And we're about set to drop the puck here on period number two. The Islanders win the draw and get their penalty killing unit off to a good start. Dumps it into the Ozone. Battling for it along the boards. Quick pass to Bailey. Here's a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. Knocks the puck away in the open ice. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it against the wall. Oh, smart heads up play to poke that one away. Both teams back to even strength. Really nice effort by the penalty killing unit on that one. Hey, I think I killed two penalties in my life. Looked to me like the penalty killers did a good job there. They didn't really give up anything. Moves the puck. Strong defensive effort. Nelson's been brought down, and we're going to get a penalty here. There's the whistle. And let's hear what the official's explanation on this one is. The Penguins are getting two minutes for tripping. Reaching for the puck, trying to be in position. You're just a little bit away, and then you get nabbed for tripping. Yeah, it's always tough to use the I got stuck excuse, right? It never works. Time for the power play unit to get back to work. Hey, another power play for them. They've been successful tonight. I don't think they changed the script much here. Nice play shorthanded as they get control of the puck. The Islanders gain control of it. Slides it across to Barzell. Goes right to the crease. Comes up with the stop. The Islanders have put a lot of pucks on net, and they continue to lead here early in the second. 
Offense his own face off, and he wins the draw. Chris one in close. Stopped by the goaltender. Sharp reaction save. Can't hang on to the puck after the play. It's a two on one. Knocks the puck loose. Quick feed to Dumoulin. The Penguins play it along the boards. New York's got the puck. Moves it to Everly. Here's a shot. That eyes him on the play. And the goalie covers up for the whistle. Oh, that's a good save. When we get a second look at this, you see how quickly the shooter delivers the puck to the net. Lots of time left in this period. New York's got some breathing room as they lead it 2 nothing. The Islanders take possession off the faceoff. Just misses! What a chance! Right in the middle! Oh. A spirited battle along the boards for the puck. And now he moves it quickly to Pedersen. Time's up for the power play. Both teams back to equal strength. Always frustrating for the power play when they go back to the bench and don't have anything to show for it. From center, they get into the attacking area. Good defensive stop with the poke check. With the steal. Into the corner of the attacking area. And a poke check knocks the puck away. New York's gained possession along the boards. Oh, and he just puts it wide of the net. You kick yourself in the tail after you miss a chance like this. Has to be on the net. Pushes it across to Rust. Here's a chance. Sends one over. And that's broken up. And that skips away on a nice defensive deflection. The Islanders move to the offensive zone. Puck battle along the boards. Nice poke check. Works it across to Gensel. Tries to get the puck to Kapanen. Can't find his man. And a great save. In front of the net, the goaltender covers up for a whistle on the play. I wanted another look at this one. I'm sure you guys were all impressed as I was. What a save by the goalie. The Islanders are checking all the boxes tonight. More shots, more goals, and they lead in the second. Good job tangling up his opponent here. The Penguins move it in. The Islanders will play it from the defensive zone. Into the offensive end now. Big play inside the defensive zone. Moves it quickly over to Clutterbuck. He grabs the puck here at the point. Oh, and it goes just wide. Just wide, wide, it doesn't matter. It's not on the net. He's got to get that at the goalie. Plays the puck up ahead. No, you're not going to get away with that one right in front of the official. Delayed penalty coming up. It's a tripping, it looks like. And the goaltender gets to the bench for the extra attacker. How do you miss that, Ray? I don't know, but we all do. You're right in a scoring zone, and you don't even test the goalie. Jankowski's called for tripping. He's off to the box. Funny, coaches always tell you, get your stick on the puck. And then when you try and the guy trips up, they tell you, get your stick out of there. You kind of stop. The Islanders once again send out their power play unit. As someone who played a lot on the power play, you get one early in a game, it gives you more confidence. They look like they're ready to get another one. Here's a short pass to Tanev. The Penguins take it across the blue line. From the slot, fires away. Made the stop on the play. Varlamov's been sharp when he's had to be. He's got a good save percentage here tonight, and his team's in good shape. Nearing the midway mark of the period. 2-0 is the score. Off the draw, and a nice job locking up his opponent. Quick pass to Everly. New York's across the blue line. And the poke check. Oh, smart play. Pittsburgh's got it in their own zone. Well, what a quick reflex stop that is. Great scoring chance. New York's lead here in the second period, a direct result of being the more aggressive team offensively. The Islanders win the draw. Quick feed to Barzell, and that's blocked. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the wall. Nice poke check inside the attacking zone. 
Pittsburgh's moving it into the offensive end. The official signaling for a penalty as play is called. The Islanders have been called for hooking. So quickly into position, now the defensive player's got to scramble. He takes the hooking penalty. Puck set to drop. We've got some four-on-four four coming up. Four-on-four four play usually starts pretty cautiously. It takes one missed pass or one missed shot, and all of us... Oh, that's going to be a penalty. They're going to have to call that. Right up front, and they capitalize for the goal! You know, James, that kills the power play, but I'd still like to see the rules amended so they would still get the power play. They earned one. Now they don't even get it. If you're the goalie here, you just want to move as quick as you can. Maybe it'll hit you, but it's so close to the net that passes on the tape and off the tape in a hurry. New York's had the puck on their stick all night, and when they haven't, it's generally been in the back of the net. They've taken the opportunities, and they've capitalized. I mean, they've had the puck a lot, James, but they've not missed much. Taken by Mayfield. His fifth of the playoffs. The Islanders gain control of the puck against the wall. And now they look to make something happen from the neutral zone. Puck dumped in. Pittsburgh's penalty has expired. They now go to work on the man advantage. Steps inside the line. Pokes it away in his own end. New York's going to be able to kill a few seconds off now with the puck. Good clearing attempt to breathe. Pittsburgh's got the puck along the boards. Into the offensive zone. The Penguins scoop it up along the boards. Aaron pass, and the play's broken up. Make it change, make it change. Moves it to Rust. New York's got the puck shorthanded. They clear the zone. The Penguins come up empty-handed on the power play. We're back to even strength here. Too passive, not aggressive enough. The puck gets moved around the outside of the penalty killers. Really doesn't become a dangerous power play. Centering pass! Moves it quickly over to Letty. Gensel's back in the play after getting a new stick at the bench. Snaps one from the slot. Great reflexes, another save. Every game, he seems to be in the middle of the offense. Seems to be finding a way to create. And he's one of the league leaders in points because of it. Crosby's one of their only hopes to get back in the game. Their deficit is so large, they're going to need a lot to go right. Scoops up the puck off the draw. The Islanders gain possession in their own end. Lee's got the puck. Kind of lost control for a speed. The goaltender, but couldn't beat the post. New York's able to lock that one off as it hits the post and stays out. But they've got such a nice big lead, they didn't need it. The Islanders will play the puck from behind the net. Exploring options here inside the defensive zone. Quick pass to Everly. Streaking through center, they go on the attack. Excellent stick work on the play. Back to the point it goes. Not able to connect. Pittsburgh's looking to break out of their own end. Takes the feed. Steps into it. Misses over the net. Nobody's going to be able to block that unless they're way off target like his shot was. The Penguins have it against the wall. Here's a short pass to Tanev. That's gloved by Barlama. Lee's point streak has been a thing to behold. You start to get superstitious on a run. You do everything the same. You wear the same suit all the time. The Islanders lead in a big way here in this second. They have been on fire offensively. New York's got a hold of the puck. Pokes it away to keep the pressure on. The Penguins gain possession along the wall. Stayed by the goaltender who stayed with it on the redirect. Oh, he had to get up tight to the puck. In close, he takes away any room. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it along the wall. Here they come. Jabs the puck away. Couldn't complete the play. They've got the defense outnumbered. And they fail to go tape to tape. Scores! On the rebound, he pops it! at this on video and not be very happy with it. They turned the puck over, and now the odd man rush develops. They can't get back to stop it.
And it looks like the hockey equivalent of going to the bullpen is happening here as they're going to change goaltenders. I'm not so sure the guy coming into the game is going to feel so excited. Their team has just been destroyed tonight. The Islanders continue to apply the pressure and the offense continues to roll. This is like a steamroller now. It's like nothing will slow them down. And play resumes as the puck is dropped. The Penguins take the in all alone. Denies him. Oh, excellent stop by the goaltender. He read that perfectly. New York's got him along the wall. Sets up from Gretzky's office. Denies him. He got all of it. Streaking into the attacking zone for the right. Here's a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. Along the boards, they battle for the puck back and forth. Regains control here in the neutral zone. Takes a shot, misses the net. You're going to go back and kick yourself for that one because he wants that on the net. He doesn't miss it by much. The Islanders get a hold of the puck along the boards and makes the save. The Islanders with a total team effort to this point as they lead comfortably here in the second. Pajot's won the faceoff deep inside the offensive zone. What a steal in his own end. And pokes the puck loose inside the offensive end. Pittsburgh's on the attack. New York's got a hold of it against the wall. Passes on over to Del Cole. Wax it into the offensive zone. Pedersen's got a hold of the puck behind the net. Takes the pass. Great hit on the play. And he serves it across to Del Cole. Through center along the wing. From the left side, it moves to the middle of the ice. New York's got the puck inside the defensive zone. Grabs control of it at the point. Gains control of the puck here at the line. There's the whistle from the linesman calling it offside. Crosby's got to know right before he takes this hit that he's going to get run over. The Islanders have generated plenty of quality scoring chances and a big reason why they lead late in the second period. Slides in off the wing after the centerman tied him up. Quick feed to Malkin. Oh, how did he come up with that stop? Slides it to Mayfield. Nelson's got it on the offensive end. Pittsburgh's got control of it now from their own end. Along the side, here they come through the neutral zone. Takes the feed at center and moves up ahead. Fails to find the open man. Loose puck battle along the boards. Here's an odd man rush. Sends it over. Oh, what a stop with the blocker by Varlamov. There's another stop. I like how he was able to follow the puck. Good save in close. As a great older colleague of mine says, this is waffle boarded away. New York's been an impressive club to watch tonight, especially offensively, as they lead big here late in the second. Puck is dropped, and we are back underway. And now he tries to get it across to Lee. Gets the full use of his stick on the poke check. New York's gained possession along the boards. The Islanders get a hold of the puck. Taken along the wall by Lee. From point blank, they score! And the Islanders fans are on their feet tonight! Well, he was brought into the game here to provide some relief in goal. No relief provided there. He gets beat. New York's performance has to have their coach smiling down the bench. Ray, what are you seeing? I guess he smiled a little bit. Coach is never relaxed, but how could he not be pleased with this? They're running a shutout, and they're running up the score at the other end. With possession along the wall. No quarter given here as they battle for the loose puck along the boards. New York's got it in their own zone. Pokes it away to stay on the attack. Pittsburgh's 
got the puck along the wall. The Penguins played along the boards with the stop. Sends the pass down low. And that one's broken up. Nice zone entry from the left. Pokes the puck away. Tanev's carrying it ahead. Slammed hard against the wall. That's a 50-yard dash and a 25-yard gym. There's the horn ending period number two. I'm not sure they wanted it to end. Hey fans, be sure to get your season tickets now at this year's playoff locations and prices. Pay the regular season ticket price for rounds one through three. That offer is a What's in store for the third period? Let's tune in to find out just moments away. Stop by section 144 on the concourse. Players are set, officials are set, third period action is coming up. Here we go, third period set to get underway, simply too much to not enough at this point. Once again, I'll send it back down to my broadcast partner, Ray Ferraro, who is at ringside. Ray, we've got two periods played. How do you see this thing? The Penguins continue to fire pucks at this goalie, but he's stopping everything. No matter how hard they work, they have not found a way to get it by him. Spectacular stop by the goaltender. How did he hang on to that? Yeah, he's right in front of the puck, too. So there's really nowhere that puck's going to squeak through. New York's been a dominant force offensively. Plenty of quality scoring opportunities, and they lead it big time early in the third. Back underway as he wins the draw inside the offensive zone. And he denied that opportunity. Shot, that's blocked. The Penguins gain control of the puck against the wall. Picked up along the wall by Lee. Couldn't connect on that pass. Cuffs up possession of the puck. They've gotten after it on this shift in the offensive zone. Centering pass, gives them nothing in front. Barlamov's got the puck and he elects to hang on for a stoppage in play. Now we're in the third period, James. It's pretty safe to say he's been on top of his game tonight. Not much has given him a problem. The Islanders lead this one early in the third period. They have been the more aggressive team offensively with the lead in the shot department. And with the two centers tangled up, the winger skates away with it. And that one stopped. Barlamov's read the situation, and he's just going to let it breathe here, Ray. Well, every once in a while, the goalie will get a sense that the guys are starting to run around. He's been on top of it tonight. Been an excellent game. Lots of time left in this period. New York's put on a smothering offensive performance. They lead it 5 0. Musa to Zucker. Can't finish. Oh, Ray, a blown opportunity. It really is. I mean, the play is sitting right there. There's a scoring chance to be had. They just don't execute it. Turn that one aside. I'd like to look at that one more time. He uses the angle to squeeze off the ice. There's nowhere to go. Dead end right there. The setters will glide into the dot. Nelson's won the draw here in the offensive zone. Simple glove saved by DeSmith. The Islanders have built themselves up a comfortable lead here in this third period. The Penguins win the draw. New York's got the puck along the boards. Off target! Grabbed along the boards by Pedersen. Receives the pass. From the right wing, he moves it to the middle. Comes up with the stop. Barlamov's going to slow things down and opts for the whistle. He's had a really good night. He's been on top of his game, and there's not been much that's given him trouble. Steps in and takes the puck. And now it's grabbed by Mayfield. New York's moving it along the wing. To the low slot. Here's a chance to set up now. Denies him with the blocker. What a stop by DeSmith. Puck grabbed by Letty. 
no rhyme or reason, but the stick implodes on the shot. You can see the frustration as he goes back to the bench to get a new one. Puck picked up by McCann. His reflexes on display tonight. Moves it quickly over to Del Cole. The Penguins scoop it up along the boards. Great pass from the left wing up the middle now. Gets control of the puck here in his own end. New York's got it across the line. Scrum ensues along the boards. Oh, he'll feel that one. Now into the offensive zone from the right side. Blocker saved by Varlamov. Puck scooped up by Boychuk. And a nice poke check inside the neutral zone. And now he passes it to Clutterbuck. And tries to make a diagonal pass to Pasho. Here's a chance to make something happen inside the neutral zone. Picks up the puck in his own end. And now he angles it across to Tanev. Right up the gut into the attacking zone. And loses possession after a solid hit. Picked up along the boards by Pulak. Takes the feed in the middle of the neutral zone. Denies him in front. Dead center. Excellent save. Taken by Malkin. Along the half wall with the puck. Can't connect. Can't connect. They fight for it along the boards. The Islanders have it against the wall. With some open space at center. Pittsburgh's got possession here in the neutral zone. Working the puck deep inside their own end. And now he moves it to Malkin. The Islanders take over on possession. Through center. Quick pass to Lee. Move to the middle. Tees him up. Misses. The Penguins gain possession along the wall. Here they come inside the neutral zone. The Islanders take possession in the defensive end. Here's a short pass to Barzell. The Islanders take it across the line. Scooped up along the wall by Pedersen. Moves it over to Gensel. Up along the wing. Well, the endless slew of penalties that have been handed out continues here as yet another one is being dished out. Ray, it looks like tripping. It's amazing how coaches get angry with a tripping penalty, but they don't seem to say much if it's a boarding penalty. It's still two minutes. Two is two, yeah. One just seems lazier, though, isn't it? Yeah, well, maybe I don't want to hit anybody, and I take a <laughs> tripping penalty. Safety first. Takes possession off the draw. Clearing attempt. And it's a small victory for the PK unit here. Well, that's their job. Get it down the ice, get off the ice, get some new people out there. Pittsburgh's in now. Here's an opportunity, and he makes the save. Barlamov's under fire, and he's going to hang on for the whistle. Sometimes you freeze it to give your teammates a breather. Sometimes you freeze it so you get yourself one. He's been really busy tonight, but he's been exceptionally sharp. The Islanders' offense has been the story tonight as they continue to lead big time in the third. Off the draw, and he ties up his opponent. And they move the puck out of harm's way. Explores his options behind the net. Using the net for cover. And now it's over to Kapanen. Pushes it across to McCann. Right in the slot. Cannon of a shot. Stops him cold. The Islanders continue to lead here in this third period. They've been the busier team offensively. Pittsburgh's won the draw and they'll go to work. Hammers it. Blocked in traffic. Scores! They deliver big time with a man advantage. Yeah, they use that extra man to their advantage. Move the puck very quickly. That's a nice goal. job is to create shots and if you can create them from the most dangerous areas of the ice you're going to be successful dead center in the slot he doesn't miss the penguins still have a lot of catching up to do but they have something to build on now yeah they do and i think what they can look forward to is the buzzer is closer to the oh, end of the game oh you went there huh 
Pittsburgh's won it. And now it's grabbed by Dumoulin. Cock moved over to Latang. A great read on the play. Quick feed to Bailey. Looking to make something happen in the offensive zone. Tried to make a move, and the puck hops away. There are times you try to do too much. He's got good hands, but maybe a more simple play is the right one there. And we've got a two-on-one. And that's picked off. Slides the puck over. Nelson's got it across the line. And that's broken up with a stick in front. Denies that opportunity. The Penguins get the puck in their own end. Pittsburgh's on the attack. The Penguins carry it along the wall. Can't catch up to the pass. Nice zone entry on the left side. Moves it to Nelson. And that one's broken up. Great block there. Xavier's gaining momentum. And couldn't find the intended receiver on that one. Moves it quickly over to Pullock. Pittsburgh's looking to break out of their own end. Takes the feed. Crosby's known as a goal scorer. He just hasn't gotten anything done tonight. Like most of his team, it's been a long night. They're getting clobbered. New York's looking to break out. Handles the puck. Steps into the offensive end. He almost lost it for a second there, but regains control of the puck. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it along the wall. From the defensive zone, they move the puck around. Nice pass. Quick pass to Dumoulin. And that's taken by the defense. Gains the zone through the middle. New York's got control of it now here in the offensive end. Oh, if there's going to be a regret in this one, that might be it. Yeah, that play is right there to be had. They just miss the pass. The scoring chance goes away. Trying to get back on the attack now. Scrum along the boards. Taken along the wall by Crosby. Here's a shot. Gets in front of it. Barlamov's got it. And he'll elect for the whistle. Jumped on it pretty quickly there. And like everything else tonight, he's really looked in control. He's had an excellent game. Oh, well, you're not going to get much better scoring chance than that one. But the goaltender makes an excellent stick save. The Islanders continue to lead big here in this third period. Pittsburgh's got it, and they're on the attack. Levels them with the hit. Good use of the body to knock them off the puck. Maintains possession. Takes the cross-ice pass. Sends the pass over. And he slides it quickly to Barzell. Puck grabbed by Ruedel. Here they come on the attack. Sends it down low. And that's broken up. Barlamov's got the puck, and he elects to hang on for a stoppage in play. Now we're in the third period, James. It's pretty safe to say he's been on top of his game tonight. Not much has given him a problem. Nobody wants to take a step back here. One team makes a hit. It seems like the other team's got to answer right away. It's been like that all game long. And a solid job tying up his opponent. New York's got it against the boards. That knocks him off the puck. The Penguins are on the attack. They've got numbers. Penalty coming up here. A little too, a little too late. And I'm sure some people in this building would have wished the clock would have just run out. Looks like tripping the call. Sometimes they're lazy. Sometimes they're just bad luck. Face off and another opportunity to take a look at the man advantage unit here. I don't think their power play's been very good tonight, James, even though they have been on the board with it. It should be a lot more precise with the talent that they have. Pittsburgh's got the puck behind the net. The Penguins in transition at center. He's gonna play it from the corner. Here's a short pass to Malkin. And he slides it quickly to McCann. Puck picked up by Kapanen. Oh, great read as he pokes it away. The Islanders get a hold of the puck undermanned. Quick feed to Sisikis. Drives it to the crease. Great chance in front, and not much on that one. Mulkin's got it in the defensive end. Puck scooped up by McCann. 
Moved into the middle, and that one's broken up. And the puck clears the zone. Pittsburgh's got a hold of it against the wall. Feeds the puck across to Gensel. New York's penalty killing unit delivers in a big way. Both sides back to even strength. The pressure points on the penalty killer have been letter perfect tonight. They've pushed at the right times. They've sagged back at the right times. Gotten the requisite saves when they need those two. And the puck leaves the zone going back to center ice. Looking to set up offensively. Takes a bump but hangs on to the puck. Pittsburgh's gained possession along the boards. Centering pass. Here's a shot. Stopped by the goaltender. Barlamov's read the situation, and he's just going to let it breathe here, Ray. Well, every once in a while, the goalie will get a sense that the guys are starting to run around. He's been on top of it tonight. Been an excellent game. New York's put in one of their most complete efforts that we have seen in quite some time, up big time late in this third. The frozen biscuits dropped, and we are back underway here. The Penguins get a hold of the puck along the boards. The Islanders gain possession in their own end. Oh, what a save by Varlamov. He's sharp on that one. Nowhere to go for the puck. The Islanders have been the busier team in the shot department, and they lead it late in this third period. Snatches the puck with the two centermen locked up. Everly's picking up steam. Strong defensive effort. Coming up on the final minute of regulation time. Stones him in front. New York's got the puck in the defensive end. Takes it across the blue line. Moves it to Lee. Tremendous. He scores! Jumps on the rebound and makes it count. Followed through to the net. He picks up this rebound, makes no mistake. Once the goalie leaves the puck in front of the net, the goalie's at your mercy, and he does not miss. The Islanders have been whipping their opponents all night long, and it continues here in the third. This has been as good a performance as you can possibly imagine. There's really nothing to say behind their bench right now. Moves it quickly over to Del Cole. The Penguins gain control of the puck against the wall. Long reach breaks up the momentum. The Islanders take it along the wall. Picked up along the wall by Peugeot. The Islanders have it against the wall. Quick pass to Peugeot. Taken by Del Cole. The Penguins take it along the wing. Sends a pass over. Skates to the crease. Off the post. The Penguins hit the goal post there, but James, I don't know how much that's really going to help them anyway. They're so far down. Such an intense battle, and they're moving on winning this one. Way more satisfaction winning a series than anything in the regular season. Now you get to keep playing. A lot of bottom lips need to be pulled up here as they go through the handshake line, Ray. Emotionally and physically, you've put everything into your season, and it's now over. That side of the line is really a tough place to be. In the meantime and in between time, he's Ray. I'm James. Good night.